Welcome, I hope you're doing well. Today we're diving into the world of crypto and AI. I'm going to show you a tool that can help you uncover the next big crypto gem. And that's the powerful combination of ChatGPT and its new DeFi Llama plugin. If you don't know it, DeFi Llama is a professional analytics website that tracks important figures and statistics about decentralized finance projects, DeFi for short. Now I know that the analytics and data on DeFi Llama can be technical and intimidating, especially if you're new to the space. That's where the power of ChatGPT comes in, allowing to ask directly for key information to guide your crypto investments in a user-friendly manner. So buckle up and let's uncover some hidden gems. Let me start first by showing you how we can access the DeFi Llama plugin. For this, you will need to have subscribed to ChatGPT Plus because the plugins are accessible on the more powerful GPT. So you see, I come here, click on GPT-4, then come down to here, and then I click on plugins. For the moment, there's no plugins enabled, so we'll install a new one by clicking here. Then I'll just come in the search bar and type DeFi, and then click on install. Okay, that's done. So we can come back here and you can see that we have selected our DeFi Llama plugin. Okay, we're all set. Let's now go through four general DeFi prompts together. The first is summarize what's happening on chain over the past day, display the results in tables. This will give us a good overall sense of the current market. He answered with three tables. The first is the top five chains or L2s that gain the most TVL. TVL stands for total value locked. In other words, the money that has been stored in the given project. And we can see, for instance, that Tron is the change that had the most TVL change yesterday, almost $26 million. And it is also by far the chain that has the most TVL locked, more than $5 billion, which is one order of magnitude larger than the second chain, which is the Ethereum L2 token optimism. Next, we have the protocols that have the highest percentage growth in TVL. So you understand TVL is really an important quantity to quantify the activity on a project. So here we can see that the protocol that gained the most TVL change yesterday is the staked USDT with an astonishing 136% change. And lastly, we have the top five yields in this table. And the first is the Morphex project on the Phantom chain that gives an APY of 115%. Seeing the symbols described here, I'm assuming these are liquidity pools, but we might as well ask ChatGPT to confirm. Okay, indeed, as expected, there are indeed liquidity pools, and he gives us a more detailed answer. So really don't hesitate to ask him when you have a doubt or you need clarifications. This is really the benefits of being able to ask directly rather than having to decipher a website by yourself. Next, we ask, list all the projects that have gained more than 50% volume in the last seven days. This helps us uncover projects that are rapidly gaining traction and could potentially be at the cost of a breakout. You can see that the list is quite long. I actually had to ask him to continue generating in the middle here. So let's have a look at the first ones. And our top one is the Umami Finance Protocol on the Arbitrum change with a crazy almost 10,000% profits change over seven day. This is indeed a good example of a DeFi protocol that is rapidly gaining attention. In terms of percent change, the second one is almost one order of magnitude less with almost 1,500, which by itself is already a huge change. Change. Third, we have what are the top five platforms to farm stable coins with the best APRs? It goes without saying, yield farming is a popular way to earn passive income in the crypto world, so we might as well look for the platforms with the most lucrative returns. It clearly seems that the beefy project on the Optimism chain is having the upper hand at the moment, where the top one returns a 30% APY and the second almost a 27% profits. Using these stablecoin pairs quoted here, you most likely already know about the USDC stablecoin. Interesting to note though, a Binance Smart Chain protocol to appear here in the middle of our top five. Finally, our last general prompt, what are the new projects on DeFi Llama with the highest increase in TVL in the past month? High TVL often indicates a project's popularity and trustworthiness. So spotting a new project with a rapidly increasing TVL could indicate a solid investment opportunity. 
Great. There was a little issue that I wanted to point out to you. It turns out that DeFi Llama only supports hour, day and week as a time period for TVL, while we asked for the past month. But what is nice is that without me having to correct or ask again, ChatGPT decided by itself to show me the result for the past week. And we have our table here. And indeed, we find again our Umami Finance project and the Satori Finance. These actually coincide with what we found when we asked for the more than 50% change in volume. Please remember that I'm not a financial advisor and this video is just about me sharing my personal opinions and experiences. Now let's have a look at four more blockchain specific prompts. I will be using the example of Arbitrum here, but typically one should look into different blockchains. Let's start with... What are the best single-sided stablecoin yields on Arbitrum? Indeed, different blockchains offer different yield opportunities, so we might as well make the most of it. If you don't know what single-sided stablecoin yields mean, it actually refers to yields where you deposit only a single type of stablecoin without the need for a paired token. This method has less risk of impermanent loss. But that also means in a certain way that the APY that you'll get is smaller Indeed, in investment in general, often we have the rule that the less risk, the less possible profits. But less risk also means a better guarantee to actually obtain those profits to each our own risk appetite. Anyway, you can see that the top one here is the USDC coin on the GMD protocol project with an APY of 11.6%. Note that all of these are still way above any savings bank account that you can get out there. But the possible risks are also different. That's true. We ask for stable coins, let's now ask for a standard coin. What are the best single-sided ETH yields on Arbitrum? We all want to get the best out of what we have. And we find again the GMD protocol as our top one with a 9% APY, which is a good 3% more than the top two provided by the HOP protocol. Then we ask, what are the top five projects with the highest liquidity on Arbitrum? High liquidity often signals a healthy active project, Okay, it seems it had a little issue the first time I tried to fetch the data, but it tried again and everything worked fine. I'm not too surprised, for example, to see protocols like the AAVE or Uniswap. You can see that we are dealing with very big numbers here. Our top one convex finance has a TVL of more than $3 billion, while the second one is $2 billion. And Uniswap V3 has almost $3 billion. You can see that he did indeed rank this top five by the TVL change over seven days. And Convex Finance is number one with almost a $241 million change in TVL over the last seven days. You can also see that the top four are all above a hundred million change. And finally, our last prompt. What are the latest emerging projects on Arbitrum? Staying informed about the newest projects can give us the early mover advantage, a crucial aspect in the rapidly evolving world of crypto. And we get these projects as our top five. Most likely you wouldn't have heard of these protocols if you're not working closely within the space of DeFi. You can see that he gave us the TVL change over one day and the total TVL as usual. But I'd be interested in knowing what made him do this ranking like this. So I think we should ask that. What metrics did you consider to give me this last ranking? Okay, so I think basically he's telling us that it is using the TVL change of a one day. But actually what he's not mentioning here is that he's ordering it not in absolute value, but in ratio or in percentage. In other words, if we look at our top one auto earn finance, you can see that the TVL change over the last day was of $66,000, which is around half of its total value locked. While the second one has V2 had a TVL change much larger, $254,000, but this is closer to one third of the total TVL. And that's it for today. Remember, the more you know, the more you grow. If you have discovered other interesting prompts, please share them in the comments down below. We're all here to learn together. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe if you feel like it. Until next time, happy investing.